Okay, we're at the Bass of Caracal on a very hot day. We had a problem getting in. The uh, tickets weren't downloading, so finally we were able to get in. I think we we're able to get into the actually the downstairs, really? yeah. It seems seems like they sent a lot of hot Oh yeah. Now why why would they do that since it's technically a different country? Uh, because the Vatican controlled everything. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah, the Vatican was like the power back then. See how big it? Yeah. There's still probably okay. so much history mm -hmm. underground. So, cousin Jim, what did you think of the Vatican yesterday? Oh, I thought it was fantastic. Very historic. Uh, uh, just this, I got a great feeling walking through there. Fantastic. All right. So I'll continue the video, but stop and go every once in a while, see some highlights. Mosaics, the actual mosaics on the walls, the floors, the workmanship, amazing. It is. <laughs> How huge this place was. Now, was there any, uh, a roof on here? Or no? Oh, yeah. Really? Yes. It's amazing how they. Now, these were mainly the baths? Yes. Baths. Wow. They had all kinds of other stuff there. It was like a social club bath. But I guess for just a week. This means new discovery and restoration, the decorations. Right here. Oh yeah. Yeah, this was here. So so there's probably more here. Well, am I some of this well here it probably it was degraded or somebody took it over the years. Oh, that was put here. That might have been a piece of art, or it might have been like a piece of steel to to shore up the wall. It looks like it'll knock down the wall. Yeah. Hmm. They certainly spent a lot of money here. Oh, yeah. Well, a lot of the money that they got very wealthy people, companies, uh, Italian companies will donate to do restorative work. Wow. Like this. Now, in some of these pools, they would literally have a bar where you swim up and have drinks. Now, were these filled with water? Oh, yeah. So where's the... Uh, Some place and underground would be the heating element to keep it warm, and that's where, yeah, that's what I'm hoping we're able to go see. That's amazing. You, you know, thousands, well, thousands, a couple thousand years ago. Yeah. That's that's the ceiling. Well, that's the arches. See the fresco on a wall? Yeah. 
that was out there? Oh yeah, all this stuff was from the ancient world. Taking pictures, or are you no, not no, interested? No, not, not of this. The Colosseum. Okay. No. Well, this is all going to be on video, so you could. What's this here? Probably another pool. But there's no tiles, though, right? No. Some places, like I said, if it was excavated, they might have taken a tile and put it somewhere else. All right. Yeah. So this was a large uncovered pool here. You see? But, but you know, you know, maybe I'm being overcritical, but I never realized what what garments the Vatican was. Oh yeah, they they got all this. Excuse me. See, they would swim up here and be on uh, the edge. But um, as I was saying, the Colosseum was built because at that time they were doing the, the siege and uh, trying to take over Israel, Jerusalem, and all the booty that they captured in Jerusalem was paying, paid for to build the Colosseum. Wow. And also they brought back, I think it was 10,000 slaves and they sold them so the government got the money from the sale of the slaves. I'm, I'm sure it was something. So probably for a period, this was just like right. Oh, for hundreds, for thousands of years, and also during the Middle Ages, after after Rome fell, uh, a lot of marble and things was was stolen, or just things were destroyed, just because they didn't want any any remnants of the Roman Empire. See that's. See, that's what I mean about destroying history, no matter how right or wrong sure. it is. You know, you really should. Now, what's what's that in Now, now that you've been here, what you can do is, when you go home, you could go on YouTube and look at a video, uh, video of the Baths of Caracal to see what it looked like 2,000 years ago. Well, what and, I would the, hope, and the history of it, too. What I would hope you could, you could send me the, the film. Oh, th this. Yeah. Oh, of course. About the water that was used here every day, yeah, and just used in Rome, yeah. sure Jim but when we think of baths it, they call it the baths but it wasn't really like a bathtub it was pools mostly pools, yeah.
see the, uh, I don't know what you'd call that on the wall, if that was a regular wooden. Well, I'm not sure that's wood. That's probably well, I, I know it's wood, but in today's time, a oh, bo the border. The border. Yeah. And that would go all the way around, and that was all hand carved. So you see all that stuff that was on the walls, all those frescoes and more mosaics. So it wasn't like a bare wall. Yeah, wow. And then once again, the mosaic. Very rude. But they just plop their faces right in front. Not thinking not thinking anybody else is there. When it could go. Take a picture in front of here. All right. Once this lady gets out of the way. Okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Well, some places were like in Naples, part of Pompeii was bombed. Really? Yeah, and they had to rebuild. What made them bomb there? Because it was the Germans. The Germans were hiding out there, or the Germans were in that area. And in fact, there was a, in Rome, there was an agreement with the Germans that they weren't going to be hanging out at like the Colosseum or the Vatican or somewhere like that. That would result in the U.S. destroying it. Now, from what I understand, the Pope at that time was sympathetic to the Germans. Oh, yeah, yeah. Germans. he didn't do anything for the Jews. No, but but there were a lot of priests that did that. But no, but not the Pope. No, I know. So you know there is a yeah. You see the tile? Oh, I guess that's tile up on that arch. Wow. Uh, let me take a look from here. No. There's so much corruption. I mean, there's a, there's a lot of good people in religious right. religion. But there's also a lot of people that are looking for power. Like yeah. I was reading something in the Times today. was the word for rude. <laughs> mm. 
no regard for other people. And what do you think that was? A part of a tower. For what reason? I don't know. Yeah. Well, when we leave, we can hang out by that little truck and grab a water or soda good, good. for a little bit. Right. Is that before the Coliseum? Oh, yeah. It's, oh, it's right out the exit here. Oh, good. Good. You're about to ask, how come I'm not a pest? No. You know, have a water. No, not at all. I just want to... 